My name is Jimmy Chin, and I am a photographer, filmmaker, skier, professional climber, and I live here in Jackson Hole, Wyoming. A lot of my ideas come to me when I'm out on my own. A big part of it is about finding inspiration. The mountains force you to be present. Having a vehicle that can really handle anything that the weather here in Jackson Hole can throw at you. I mean, conditions can change dramatically, so that's something I really appreciate. Hey, Jimmy, how are you? Good to meet you. Let's roll. So given where I live here in Jackson, do you think this is a good vehicle for me? So a plug-in hybrid's really good for short stuff in electric and longer journeys in conventional engine. So how do you choose when to use electric and when to use petrol? The plug-in hybrid has three modes. The first one is automatic, then fire and forget, let the car decide. The second one is all EV, and the third one is what we call save. So you might be commuting to a larger town or larger city, which saves some energy for further down the road. I'd imagine there must be huge batteries to be able to power a vehicle of this size. So you're right, there's a big battery, and it's packaged in a way that's not going to influence how you're going to use the vehicle. You can still put your skis and your luggage in the back and not have to fit it around a battery. Did you have to compromise on any of the capabilities of the Range Rover because it's a hybrid? It's uncompromising. By choosing a plug-in hybrid, you don't have to change your lifestyle. The car works with you. And honestly, it's great for my family too because I feel like it's a really safe